Hello and welcome back to Stranded Deep. Last time we were trying to smoke some pilchards and we still are not able to do it. We stacked the campfire up. It is still cooking, so that's good. We have a bunch of uh, arrows. Uh, it's 11.29, so it's already kind of halfway through the day. Food is a bit down. We had some coconut earlier to just kind of get us through. These fruit trees are not doing much. We have survived 18 days. Good. Uh, let's go back to Shark Pier and actually see if any sharks have uh, come back. One of the things I haven't done, ooh, maybe we can kill a seagull. Maybe we can just... Oh, you asshole. You complete asshole. You just came down and scared your friend away. What a butthole. Okay, let's go back to Shark Pier and see what's going on. I don't know if we can kill seagulls. It would be an interesting thing, but then I don't know if the, the model or anything exists. Uh, we did have last time some sharks swimming around, or a sharks, no, two sharks. There was a black fin and there was a tiger shark. And we had scary tiger shark music, but we also had black fin sort of puttering around being a black fin. Fine. We want the tiger shark to be in this area here because it's shallow and allows us to get it, you know, from the bottom of the sea up. I've got a bit of uh, grit under my mouse. I'm just going to clean that off. It's a glass mouse mat. <laughs> You get a, like a little bit of sand under there or something, and then it completely makes it like weird. I think there is a shark down there, but I haven't heard the shark music. Sort of, um, yeah, great, brilliant. Starfish, you can't do anything with, even though they are fish, you can't eat them. Shark Pier doesn't seem to be yielding results. Now, we haven't turned the game off, but we have been to Rock Island and back. And we did have sharp music over where Esri is. I think that was that one over there. Yeah, there. Ah, whoa, hey, Mr. Spiky, there you are, you asshole. Come back, come back. I, I, I don't want to kill him out in deep water because I don't want to drag his carcass from deep water to this to thing. I, I know I'm making it more difficult for myself, and you know it kind of makes it a little bit more boring to watch, but. We do have a genuine fear of the sea, and I keep going on about this. And, I, and we did find last time that actually, no matter how dark the sea is on top, it does seem to be a little bit lighter underneath if you stick your face under the water, which is fine. But these assholes underwater, you know, I'm not entirely too sure. I think they have about 300 health. Uh, I don't think they can destroy man made objects, so I don't think they do tool damage anymore. Where are you? He, whoa, he's booking it. He is absolutely booking. There's a weird thing where you, when you zoom in and zoom out with a bow, uh, the sky gets like loads of little dots and stuff. I'm, I'm wondering if that's part of the rendering engine. See, I can drop him right, right now. I can just do him. But I don't want to do him because I don't know how deep that area is. And it looks deep. If we stand here, is he going to come around and sort of Mr. Spikey, sing me. Oh, there you are, you asshole. Where are you? You can you can occasionally see his fin above the water. Interesting um, tessellation as well. Lovely, beautiful, uh, watery tessellation. Nice. Uh, I didn't. I still didn't work out how to work the torch. I did look it up on the internet. Uh, the 0 .0 0 0.14 patch doesn't seem to have done much in... Uh, I mean, nobody seems to be talking about how to turn the damn torch on. So I can't turn the torch on. I can't equip it separately. Like, a head torch would be really quite useful. There you are. There you are. There's another one in your butt. Are you coming back? Seriously, I generally just spend all the time standing on this damn pier, staring out to sea like a... A goddamn widow's walk. <sighs> I had a husband, but he was on a boat, and the boat sank. And I was like, oh no, better get a tattoo of his dead face on my leg. Like, I don't know why she's suddenly from Biker Grove, but whatever. It is a bit of a, a bit of a weird thing. I have seen, oh there you are, you asshole. I missed. I think I hit the seabed like half a mile away. Fine, whatever. Yeah, there's a bit of a weird thing. Um, tattoos at the moment. I come from a fairly large family. And of, I suppose, you know, there's four kids, a few sort of um, uh, stepkids and stuff. And two, uh, like my brother and my sister, have tattoos. And me and my other sister don't. 
Did he just die? Oh yeah, there he is, on the fucking seabed. He is dead. Right. Uh. Right. He just sank like a goddamn stone. The interesting thing about tattoos is that um, people get them. There's another shark. What? Hang on. Mr. Spikey is dead on the seabed down there. I can see his tail. There's another shark. What? 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 Oh, there you are. I think that might be Jaws or Mrs. He's dead. Right, so that's two sharks down. That was a lot easier than I expected it to be. So yeah, people get tattoos. Oh, bloody tattoos and dead sharks. What is this all about? So people get uh, tattoos of dead sharks. Um, no, like dead grandparents. That was the thing I was trying to uh, say. A lot of people trying to get things like that, that mean stuff to them. They're like, oh, this means a lot to me. I like this thing that I got stuck on my skin. And that's fine, whatever. But it's the one where they get tattoos of like dead grandparents and stuff. And you're like, okay, this is going to get a bit weird. Okay, it doesn't seem to be too much down here. Mr. Spiky, where are you? 800. Can we get your body up? On the shore. Yeah, so you're like, oh, you're a pretty girl. I will take you back to my place and I'll romance you. And then she goes, oh, I'm a pretty girl. Why don't you romance me? And I'm like, yeah. And then she takes her like top off and she's got a full chest tattoo of some dead person. Holy shit, this is big. I have not seen one of these. Like, Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm having such a bad day. Oh, I'm having a terrible day. I think I might, I might, I might just have a lie down. Oh, just a lie down on the beach. Okay. Okay. Is there another one out there? Yeah, he died somewhere down there. That's really deep. Um, see um where are you you asshole no i think we're gonna we've, we've lost the other one we've lost the other one lads sorry it's too deep for me to go down there again um yeah so right okay this presents an interesting thing let's just take him back to base camp i guess because the sun's going down uh we have no real way of uh getting Getting our torch working still. This look at jiggly physics. Uh, jiggle, 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 jiggle physics. Jiggle physics. It's called jiggly bones in computer talk. Uh, what you do is you you make a you make a model, and you say the model can flex. Um, I'll give it like a skeleton, which is essentially like a, a stick figure skeleton. And what we'll do is we'll say that oh, I'm walking up its tail. That's why. What what, what we'll do is we we'll, we can actually make it. Uh, flex at these points, but they only flex by a certain amount and uh, by a certain speed, and it's called jiggle bones. Um, can I can I actually drag this back to base camp before the sun goes down? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Good. He is heavy as anything. Like, really heavy. Come on, you asshole. Good to see that bug's still in there then. So you can use dead shark carcasses to fly across the island. Um, oh. I think we're still dragging him on by virtue of the fact that we it's just us and our pet dead shark. We're walking in the air. We're walking in the air. Cause we are. We're walking in the air. Accompanied by a dead shark. Yeah. So I think they patched the you can walk in the air using... Uh, cool. Using sticks. Uh, like, let's just eat these things. 
uh, using, what, what am I thinking? Using logs. You can't use logs anymore. Nope, that's just leaf. Fine, get him back to where the light is. So yeah, I'm guessing about 10 hours. Um, and shark, I, I think what I'm actually doing is just walking on top of the shark model rather than actually um, actually flying. I think that's that's basically what's happening. Fine. So we'll we'll get Mr. Shark. Fine. Fine. Oh, I'm so tired. Good. Do these fish actually do anything? You know what I'm going to do? I can't eat it. I I can't, I, I, I fucking know. I can't eat it. I wanna. Smoke that pilchard. Smoke him red. So what do I do with the tiger shark? I mean, do I just jab him up? E to interact? Do I do I just keep hitting him with a machete? Do I do I? They were supposed to fix that. The the one point four update was supposed to fix the flashy flash flash on the horizon. I'm thinking I just keep smacking him with a machete until he becomes like less shark and more shark fillets. I thought that was how it was supposed to work. I think I'm just going to wear out my machete. Um yeah. Just use the use the hatchet. Use the force look. No, oh no god no. I just, I remembered. I remember. I remember. You need to make a knife. You need to make a knife. A cotton picking knife. I think that was it. We need one stone tool. Shoot. We need a stone tool, which means we need stone. I don't think we've got any stone to make stone tools. Um, all the crap's upstairs, so let us... Or do we have a knife? Uh, do we have a knife in our, in our big pile of crap? No. We have a label maker. We don't have a knife. Um, see stone tool. Oh, there must be some rocks nearby because we can make a stone tool. Fine. Um, see um, knife. So we have everything to make a knife. Fine. So we'll make the knife. We'll equip it. All right. Now I think. Hold E to skin. Right. Okay, lads. We need a natural knife. We can't use the machete. He just said, oh, it's disgusting, like he's playing. Wait, that's, that's a, that's a, um, Far Cry 3 reference? Oh, uh, it's disgusting, that's disgusting. Oh, so the shark's disappeared. Oh, now we can pick up all the arrows. Right, cool. So the arrows, which were in the shark, Mr. Spiky, Okay, yeah, all right. So it might be worth going out and picking up like, the other shark's carcass. So that means hold E to skin. So we actually have to... Right. Gross. Where's the other pilchard? Um, is it in our inventory? No. Did we drop it on the floor? No. Pilchard. Uh, it's somewhere nearby. Oh yeah, it's just kind of floating in the air. Why does he keep? Why does he keep saying, "Oh, it's disgusting" and "Oh, it's gross"? What? Are you fucking kidding me, Sunshine? Okay, all right, all right. So we've we've had to manufacture a knife in order to make steaks, right? So these are shark steaks. These are large meat, and we can pop them in the smoker. I think this is gonna work because the the cooking the fish carcass did not work before. Right, and we can jam these bad boys in here. Okay, and I think if we drop these fish fillets down, these like small meat. Yeah, all right lads, I think we got it cracked. So these need to be above the fire in the smoke in order to cook. And I believe this is gonna work. So we need to keep the campfire burning, which probably means we're gonna need to pick up that uh, log from over there and actually turn it into let's pick up the trunk let's come back with the trunk and let's just uh, straight 
mash it down into... Yeah, we still... Okay, so we've, we've managed to kill a shark. We've managed to kill two sharks. The other shark body is out at sea. I don't know what's going to happen. If I leave it out there, it's probably going to rotten or something. I don't I don't actually know what happens to that. Uh, so we can pick up this driftwood. Fine. We can equip the driftwood, but I don't think we can... Yeah, we can actually stack the fire up. So this stuff is apparently going to cook now. Fine. Good. So I can put that away. So we got our sh we got our arrows back, which is cool. I don't think there are any more arrows in the ground uh, from Mr. Spikey. Um, Jules's mum is still out there with a bunch of arrows in her. But yeah, it does look about 10 arrows for a shark. Um, and I'm guessing about eight um, eight javelins, eight uh, crude spears for also a shark. But they do sink. As soon as they die, they sink like a rock to the bottom of the sea. And that's what I wanted to avoid. Uh, and I wasn't crazy. I wasn't crazy when I said, oh, I do want to avoid having to go swimming to get the dead shark back. I might go and get the other shark carcass off the seabed only because it's going to give us a bunch of cooked meat and it's also going to give us um, our arrows back. And we now have a 24 um, plus 3. So we actually have an extra arrow from the time when we started before. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I think, uh, knowing now what we know, um, I'm probably going to leave it there. So I'm going to leave it there for this episode. If you're liking this, please like, favorite, and subscribe. Tell your friends about the channel because that really does help us. And I will catch you next time.